So, hi guys again. Today is about hacking the TI inspired CAS. And here I've got the Endless 1.7 beta 1 and the Game Boy Color emulator and the shell enter script. So, we are on the link software and here we have the TI Inspire connected via mini USB to my Mac. I already linked them so here I can now create a new folder. Let's call it Endless. So we've got the Endless folder here like you can see. And now into this Endless folder these files all in there the insert the reset these are all ARM binaries by the way so you can write an ARM assembly or C and compile it to ARM let's just Get some new folders like Gamber Color Emulator. So, um, you can see, like, the files are all here. And now we have got the Game Boy Color. Uh, let's get the Game Boy Color file moved to here. So we got it here. Let's unfold it all or expand all. the examples. So we've got the game by color emulator and let's get the shell. Uh, I think we made a new folder. I like the new folders. Waiting. I hate it. Oh this software is a Now let's get the... No, oh, fuck it. What is this crap? No. This is real creepy software. The shell... No, oh, we just need the CAS because I don't only have a CAS. And we get it copied to here. So let's try if we can run code. First, let's try the... Hello world beta. Well, let's try the particles beta. And it sends me this document format is not supported particles beta TNS. Well, let's run the hack. It's this ins file. And we get the clock. You see there's running code. This flashes the screen black like booting. On the console and the emulator we see some booting stuff running so I think he's kind of rebooting but not loading the OS or stuff like that, I don't know. Do this with the res files. Flashing. Clock disappearing. Well now let's try the particles beta. And like we see, another pop-up comes out telling me the controls of this. Hitting OK. 
and we get the particles beta and I don't think if you can see it but the screen changed so there is definitely a program running so if I hit plus we get two particles I think you can see them now maybe very low Okay, so like you can see, it now crashed. Let's exit it and let's try the Game Boy Color emulator. So okay, no ROM files found. That's exactly what we want. So we can run native code now, and that's really great. So the GI Inspire is hacked. Uh, let's see what we get if we enter the shell. Sorry for my shadow. 